Homo sapiens are the superior most species in the animal kingdom. With a cranial capacity of 1350 cc. Having the most intelligent organ that ever existed, the human brain. The human brain is a natural supercomputer. Comprising of more than 100 billion neurons, the basic processing unit of nervous system. The neurons never undergo cell division and the number of neurons can increase only by generation of new neurons or neurogenesis. This process of generation of new neurons is maximum between the age of 4 to 15 years and almost ceases thereafter giving us a window of 11 years to work upon the developing brain. The human brain is considered to be divided into two parts, the left hemisphere and the right hemisphere. Different responsibilities have been assigned to different parts of the brain. While the left or logical brain is responsible for use of logic, numbers, calculations and identification of black and white colors, the right or creative brain is responsible for identification of colors, imagination, concentration, recall and photographic memory. It has been observed that in an average human being, only one part of the brain is predominantly more active or developed. 90% of the human population are having a predominantly more active left hemisphere which controls the right side of the human body and are right-handed. Only 10% left-handed humans have a predominantly more active or developed right hemisphere. There are a few examples of individuals who are having excellent logic, reasoning, concentration, recall, photographic memory and imagination. Commonly, we call them genius. Scientifically, they are normal humans with equally active right or left hemisphere of the brain or a completely developed brain. While a blessed few have this God gift, others can also achieve holistic brain development if worked upon properly at the right age. A typical abacus is a frame with rods and beads on which calculations are done by movement of beads and using certain formulae. Initially, Children learn to solve the arithmetic numericals by physically using the abacus instrument. Soon after, they are able to visualize the abacus and start calculating by moving the beads mentally without using the instrument. In this way, children learn to solve complex arithmetic calculations at great speed while they are having fun. When a numerical is asked, generally most people who do not have a completely developed brain will solve the same within the left or logical brain because by default all the numerical stimuli are received and processed in the left hemisphere only 